Well, Ian, massive performance today. Um, a point at home, a crucial game. What's your take? Yeah, I, I thought we'd give it a real go today. Um, obviously, it's a shame we couldn't see the game out. It was just obviously from the start of it when we've had the scenario with the goalkeeper. Seven minutes injury time, uh, sorry, first half, and then second half, we've had the lines was pulled hamstring. So uh, I think it was 13, 40 minutes injury time. So it was obviously really difficult to, uh, to get momentum going. And I felt they, first half, thought we were better than them. I think second half they got on top a little bit and we we just felt we'd got a little bit deep trying to d defend and, and didn't get hold of the ball well enough. But I, I will, I don't know, after they scored, I felt the last 15 minutes, even though they were dangerous, we've had three or four really good chances to win the game. But um, this morning, obviously, when I'm looking, we want to go into the last game knowing that it's in our hands as such. You know, and we know now if we do win on, on Saturday, you know, bar, you know, we, we'll be safe, obviously, from goal difference, you know. So that's, that's now, it, it's important that we understand that. We haven't, we ain't safe yet, you know, it's, it's a massive point today to get us off the bottom. Um, and, and I say we're training Wednesday, they're looking forward to Saturday. Um, but the last three years, it's gone, you know, obviously we've been down to the last game of the season, it's tiring, it's hard work. Uh, but I can't fault the players today, I thought they are excellent. And I just think, you know, when a couple of young lads who've come in, TJ, um, Tariq, sorry, at the right back, and, uh, and Charlie Bennett, absolutely exceptional. You know, two young lads who, um, who, who come through the youth um, uh, are putting unbelievable performances today. And uh, you know, I just thought special mention them because I think it's, they've come in at a time when obviously it's, it's hard. You know, I'd rather blood kid younger players when when we, we you're flying, and we haven't been able to do that. And obviously because of the situation, we've got to throw them in at the deep end, and they've got to sink or swim, and, and them two are swimming, which is great. The start of the game, obviously a bit of a fortuitous start for us. The keeper bob, the bob, ball bobble before the keeper yeah. um, kicked it, but we done well to, to to get a goal. But there seemed to be a big push. From from the sidelines, a lot of energy in the in the first sort of twenty twenty five minutes. Was was that the game plan today? Yeah, we just you know they've they've bit bit like us recently. They like we had this scenario of playing loads of games quickly, and that was their obviously they played Saturday, Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday. Um, you know, and we knew that, and we wanted to get up, get around them quickly in the first half. We did that, and you know, I, I feel first half maybe a little bit aggrieved that we I mean we hit the post. I think uh, for Neda, we um, Charlie Bennett had a chance. You know, we we've, we've probably had a f some set pieces. We look really dangerous, and we we, look, we could have quite easily got the second goal. And obviously, then it's a different game. Uh, but all, all the while, it's one nil, as it's been all season. It's nervy because that's where you are in football when you're one nil and you're, you're down the bottom. It gets nervy. But I, you know, overall, um, I felt we acquitted ourselves really well. Um, and you know, Josh, obviously, my goalkeeper from t three years ago, he's made a great save at the end on his near post, where um, you know he's got us the point and. Uh, he was a bit disappointed with the goal. I think uh, it bobbled, it's got kicked out of his hands. Not, it wouldn't have fell. I think our own player kicked out of his hands. Um, and then obviously he's, he's redeemed himself a fantastic save. So that's all to play for. And uh, at the start of the morning, if you'd have given me the scenario, I would have took it. So you know, we're pleased that. Yeah. You, you've mentioned some big performances out there. Charlie Bennett was obviously the sponsor's man of the match today. You mentioned a couple of weeks ago um, Pat Harding. And again, today, what an amazing performance for a guy that you know a lot of people saying sort of to, heading towards the end of his career. Yeah. Uh, I mean, the guy was still running hard at the end of the game. You know, you must be so chuffed having a player like Pat on board, and also as I say we can't forget Charlie yeah. M O M today. Great performance in midfield. Yeah, I, I think with Pat um, Fisky, you know, they've been here a long time now. Pat's on 34, 35, but and Fisky's obviously 30, and uh, and they've been with me a long time, and and I know what qualities they've got. Um, Pat really, Fisky on the guard himself, he's both for, but Pat looks after himself and, uh, you know, Fisky's naturally fit, lad, so he gets up and down, but Pat does it more than anyone, you know, all the young lads at the club, I like to, I like, love them training with Pat to watch how he trains and how, how he looks after himself, you know, and I think that's why, as I say, his age, he's um, one of them players who, who you, you tr I trust so much, you know, since he's been at the club, there's, uh, there's players who I go, go, Pat, go play left wing, go play right back, go play, and he just does it, he gets on it for you and you don't ever hear him moan or anything. Um, and he's, he's, a, he's great in the change room, he's great around the place, and he is, for the younger lads coming through, he's, he's uh, obviously, when they're not pro, it's amateur football, but they should look at him to have a career in this, at this level, how well he's done, Pat, with the tools he's got. You know, and he, well, he has got, he's also a good footballer, you know, he's a real good footballer, and uh, I'll say he works his socks off, and, and, you know, it ain't the end for him, because of, he ain't naturally quick, so he ain't gonna lose no pace as such, he just, he keep getting up and down the pitch like he does, and I'm sure he's got a few more seasons left in him. You mentioned earlier, um, you know, you're you're, in, you're happy that we go into the last game of the season. The fact that it's now in our hands. Yeah. I mean, have you got a, an, a, an approach um, to next weekend, or are you and Stuart going to sit down? No, we, we sit down. I think that the thing is with it, we, we, the thing today, which is can be dangerous. We're not like a point don't keep us up, so it's almost like no, we've got to win a game of football. So I think it take it almost like makes its its own choice that we've got to go for it because, you know, last week we do sit back, sit back. 
get a nil nil or one or something and then find it one one nil and you go down so we're you know we're having a look at it in the week see where we are but at the moment you know our, in our own minds we've got to win Saturday you know and I think it's it's one of them where you know we do know that which we do when we start where you know obviously two in now it's, not, it's in our hands which is what I said the other day that I'd rather, rather be in their position and, and they're pretty rather be in our position now you know the, the worst scenario we both lose and we still start you know so that's we've got ourselves off the bottom um, but it's all to play for, you know, and I'm just, I'm really pleased that we've given ourselves the opportunity. Um, and, I, I, you know, again, I, I, I've said it in the programme notes, I'm not going to roll ground, but the fans, are, you know, brilliant. The, the support here again today is a big crowd, I thought, and, uh, you know, they're really getting behind, they're all the support, supporting the team. You know, when the other team scored, they don't get on the players' backs, they help them out and rally them. And I think that's a, been a big part of, of us being able to give ourselves a chance of staying up. You know, I think they've, they've done wonders for the team, especially when they've been tired. I think they've dragged us through like a day, they was, you know, at the end, they were dragging us forward, which is great. Yeah. Well, great team performance today, chap, as well done. Good luck next week. Cheers, Colin. Thank you. Cheers, mate. Cheers, mate.